I'm Andrew Marabito from New York, New York, 2010 inspired bartender, and I'm making the Sapphire Emerald Fizz. My cocktail is a anise-based cocktail based off of one of the 10 botanicals of Bombay Sapphire Gin. I'm gonna start off the drink with cucumber, lemon juice, and lime juice, three quarters of an ounce of blue agave nectar, and I'm gonna muddle that together with fresh tarragon. Now tarragon and star of anise are all in the same family, so it kind of brings all of the flavors all together. Next, I'm gonna add the most essential part, Bombay Sapphire Gin, which in my eyes is the world's best gin for cocktails, simple or complex. And I'm gonna add an ounce and a half of this to the drink. Next, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna crack an egg and I'm gonna separate the yolk from the white. And what the egg white does is it gives the drink a body. And it also just makes everything kind of smooth and creamy. Next, I'm gonna transfer this from my glass to my shaker. And before I start shaking, I'm gonna wash out my martini glass with a French liquor, which is anise-based. What that's gonna do is basically, it's gonna give a back hint throughout the drink, so when you drink it, it'll hit the back of your palate. Now I'm ready to shake. And what you wanna do with your adding egg whites is you wanna shake dry first, and that just basically gets the egg going and working, creating a foam. So now I'm ready to add my ice, and now I'm gonna shake hard. Next step is I'm gonna double strain this cocktail into the glass. And double straining is basically a way to keep all of the solid parts out of the drink and create a much smoother, creamier finish. Final product, my garnish, is fennel pollen. And this is really the first thing that's gonna hit your lips, and that's, again, in the anise family. So it's gonna give you that first hit of the licorice. And there you have it, the Sapphire Emerald Fizz. Please remember to always drink responsibly.